Hey guys, it's Brother Paul here. I um, want to share a dream I had this morning. I hope everyone's well. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Hope you're enjoying a beautiful day like I am here. Um, let me set up this dream, okay? So last night when I was going to bed, I've been praying about a lot of different things lately, but I, I basically asked God, I said, there are a lot of people that I've talked to about Jesus and how he's the only way and especially I hate to use these terms because it sounds so mean but I'm just putting it categorically like I speak to some people that are idol worshipers and they don't think they are so I said what what is it God that I could say that you could show me that they're not getting and I was kind of asking God along the lines of the group of people that are so obsessed with science that science is their religion so th th that's that's the area that I went into in prayer so I went to bed and I just said God I'll share whatever you show me and I left it at that so I fell asleep and I began to have uh, a series of dreams <clears throat> Uh, I fell into a very, very deep sleep. So this one, when I was having these dreams, I was having trouble waking up, which doesn't happen very often. But the last dream that I had was the one that stuck with me. It, it's funny, they're all related, but this is the one that I'll tell because it's the one that I believe that the Lord wanted me to put forward first of all. So here's the dream. So... I, I doubt I'll find pictures. I'll do my best to put pictures together for this. But I saw a very tall building. And it had something on top of it. At first, I couldn't tell what it was. But it looked like a flying saucer. And I noticed a huge cable was attached to it. So this, imagine my, my fist is the building. This thing was parked on top. I saw people pushing it off with like mechanism or I don't know what they were pushing it off but they pushed it off and when it fell forward it came downwards and at the very last minute when the cable caught it smashed into the building so whoever I was witnessing through or maybe I was just in spirit seeing this I followed into the building and I saw many men all over the place and they were discussing how they were going to arrange this for the future explanation they were going to give for it and then i heard voices in the background and i followed them and it went down into a basement that went down into tunnels now when these men arrived at where they were in the tunnel i saw different men of different skills of artistry i saw sculptures i saw painters and i'm not really sure what the other guy was a linguistic guy maybe but they were putting images on the wall so i saw a guy sculpting what looked like a roman amphitheater with you know people walking all over the place and another man walked by and criticized it that it looked too perfect so with i don't know what he had in his hand like a chisel or a hammer but he started making it look more broken up and older and then a, a man would follow him after and kind of paint it in a way that made it look old and more de decrepit and then I followed these men through the tunnel system and this is what they were doing they were they were inventing history pieces that were made to look ancient and the dream ended oh hang on there's one more part I saw a man in there I forgot to tell you this. so I have a brother named Leonard and I have a brother named Daniel in these dreams uh, the man that was the sculptor slash painter, he, he represented, and it's funny, as I was uh, driving around today doing errands, I was talking to God, like, you know, like, who is, why are you showing me my brother? And, and the name Leonardo da Vinci came to mind. So he was a very gifted painter, inventor, you know, blah, 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 whatever. So I know that he was a known Freemason, and maybe God was trying to tell me that some people of the past that are in those kind of uh, secret societies maybe they invented history pieces and later at, at the end of the dream I saw my brother Daniel which in my dream I remember hearing in the spirit the book of Daniel and I forgot to mention 
that the man that was walking around doing the critiques was the man in power. And I also heard, like, it was like a whisper, like, Antichrist. So I don't know if it was the spirit of Antichrist on these people or if it was the actual future revealed Antichrist. I have no idea. So that's the dream. Um, God definitely gave me my uh, confirmations to, to put this out. So take it to God. Please pray on it. Use your discernment. And I love you very much. And I know for a fact that God told me to share this. So have a good day. I love you. Bye.